Hey there, what are we doing today? Well, today it is Savings Challenge Monday. Welcome back to the channel. As always, I'm super glad you're here. My name is Lisa. Myself and my husband are in our early 60s. I'm retired and my husband is still working full time, probably till at least 65, his choice. All right, what are we doing first? Well, first is show me the love. Oh, let's move some of this money. I was just trying to press you with some of this cash that I had laid out. All right, we have $40 and what we do with that, gonna zoom you in, hold please, is we are going to do show me the love. And this is where you guys leave me a like on Monday's video, today's video. Leave me a like, 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 as Ange over at Budget Debt would say. And last week I had 131 likes. Thank you so much for coming by, coming back and stopping by, watching the video, leaving me a like. That always makes me happy. I do not have room up here. Let's move things around. All right, so we have 131 times 0.25 because each one is worth a quarter that's can you see that 32.75 33 dollars we'll round it up to 35 let's put that in there let's find a marker i have all these markers and they're all shoved in here and i can't pull them out so there's that so we'll put in 35 dollars and we'll color it in green this, this week has been warmer. I know, weather is so, so crazy. We're having a warm snap. It is probably 80 degrees today, rain tomorrow. Okay, today is Saturday. FYI, today is Saturday. Filming it a little bit early. Tomorrow will be Sunday. It's gonna rain all day, mostly, like 50%. Here and there, depends on where you are. You might get it all day, you might, might not. And then we're back to the cool weather again. Yay, so happy for the cool weather. We don't get enough cool weather and you, you know i sound like i whine about the cool weather but i really like it you know i adjust it's fine it's certainly not forever all right show me the love is getting 35 do we have a five in here yes put this five out and put this 40 in one two three four i allow myself for each paycheck every two weeks i pull out 80 bucks put it in here and usually I put about 35 to $40, depending on the likes, into this challenge. This challenge originally, when we started it probably over a year ago, was to fund our medical deductible, which is $1,000 each year. We kind of spent that last year and I'm pretty sure we'll spend it this year, but that's the way it goes. We've kind of planned for it with this challenge. I use these challenges to help make saving money fun because if it's not fun, you don't want to do it. All right, so what do we have so far? We have 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, 20, 40, 60. We have $150. Not bad. I'm, I'm pretty happy with that. That is okay. So we have two more weeks left on this sheet. And I am going to do it again because it keeps me consistent. It keeps me showing up on Mondays. It keeps me saving money. So there you go. That is that. So let's get over here to this other challenge that I can't stop. Um, oh, th that is not this money. I have another one after that. This is this is this is going to be a short and sweet video, <sighs> and that's okay. So I have this leftover five. And pause. I did get this particular challenge from Veronica at Forty Plus Life. Okay, back to this one. And this one is from Mandy's Budgeting Items, also on Etsy. And when you finish it, it will equal $348. I am going to use it for a down car, a down car? No, a car down payment. When it is completed, I'm gonna apply it to what I already have saved. Hopefully, I have to go back to the dealer with my car in two weeks, and that's never cheap, but it's okay. Um, I'm sure it'll be okay. I'm sure it'll be fine. I think they have to change the serpentine belt. The car is 10 years old. It has 77,000 miles. So yeah, yeah, safety first. So we're going to do that. Let's get into this car down payment. Uh, low denominations. Love this challenge. Makes me super happy. We're going to start with, no, we already did that color. We'll do some yellow. We'll do yellow again. And we'll see what we can fill up. 
I've put a little bit aside here left over I think this is left over from grocery so that is five six seven eight so that's thirteen dollars that we can put in there and we will I think we're gonna just gonna can 13 get rid of the sixes and the fives that just makes so we have a six six so that'll be six dollars that we can put away then we have this another six like my addition skills don't always work I always need a calculator but off camera I do I mean I have a brain it does work and then we'll do this one right here this is uh, just for me very satisfying to do it's kind of short and sweet I get to fill up some envelopes and I don't um, have to wait so long to finish the challenge and because it's low denomination I was thinking there did you, did you hear that pause oops I was thinking um, I was thinking why didn't I like this when I had you know the large amounts when it was like 100 99 98 because that's all I could really save in one fell swoop I couldn't spread the money around and make it fun for me and um, I kind of didn't like that so that was another reason this way you can have a little bit of cash and it doesn't matter it's just a dollar, two dollars. You can make this your own amount. You can just make it two dollars each or whatever. And that's what's great about budgeting. You do what makes you happy and what works for you. So the last time I did this, I finished it in two months. I was hyper-focused. I do get hyper-focused on things. Um, and I'm hyper-focused on Christmas actually, but I'm gonna try to slow that down. All right, so this is done. We're just gonna kind of let it happen it won't be done in two months because you know that would be february 26th so we don't have to worry about that but maybe march no I'm kidding i don't know so yay super excited about that next we are just going to work on my holiday binder this is the minor holidays that i prepare for all year i pull out uh, 50 dollars a paycheck yeah i mean i've been doing this for a while i'm like why can't you remember I don't know. Why can't I remember? I mean, oh, please. Let me just shut this and get this out of the way. Okie dokie. Thank you so much. Less crowded. I've already pre-filled some of the, well, all of the ones that we are going to use. And the minor holidays, I just like finding them all year round. And I'm not caught off guard by incidentals. Like if the kids come over and they want to bake cookies or we're going to bake a cake. The grandkids. Um, then it doesn't break my budget so for whatever holiday it is or if they need extra like Halloween if they need extra stuff for Halloween fine we'll go get it all right so Valentine's Day it's gonna get $20 that'll bring us up to 160 usually you know I only put like five or ten into these why 20 well we all know how Halloween no no Lisa it's Valentine's Day is my husband's birthday it's a big deal for him we have to have a cake we have to have the whole thing it's it's his thing that's his holiday he loves it it's all about him and we make it all about him 160 20 40 60 81 10 15 20 25 30 35 40 45 50 55 60 this of course will cover the public's cake which are not that inexpensive anymore and a gift which i've been kind of stashing money aside secretly um so he'll have a little something extra for his birthday you know we, we want to make it about him that makes him happy it's 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 a hoot to see he loves it he is like a little kid at a birthday party easter has 70 and we're going to leave that for right now we're, we're not going to we haven't really filled that up since september and that's okay except my little neighbor friend he's he's eight he's seven now and he asked this weekend miss lisa are we going to be doing the easter egg hunt in your yard again what I go, when's Easter? Well, Easter, I had to look it up, is March 31st. So I will be starting to add to this a little bit more so we can do our little activities we do with him and uh, my grandkids. So <laughs> oh. so luckily I have this. I don't, I don't feel too stressed about it. Mother's Day is going to get $10 and that will bring us up to $150. And this will, all of these holidays pretty much revolve around eating out. And we will go out to eat on Mother's Day for the whole weekend. I don't know how we're going to stretch that however much we get, but it's going to work because I'm not cooking. 
and Father's Day. Ooh, let's put this back in here. <clears throat> let's not get all kinds of sidetracked. Father's Day is going to get 10, and that'll give us 135. We'll get that up there once we get done with the birthday. Let's see, 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, 35, 40, 45, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, I can make my bank from there and then I can post a video. Do y'all do that? Probably. Probably. And, uh-oh. 10, 20, 30, 40. Why am I missing $5? I'm not gonna worry about it. Christmas is gonna get five. I'll find that $5. Maybe you'll find that $5. You can let me know in the comments that I can move that money around. $5 is for Christmas dinner. Yeah, I don't know. Is Lisa going to do Christmas dinner this year? I'm not sure. But um, I may ask my middle son to take it over. He may be happy to take it over. Him and his wife have a perfect place for entertaining. And um, I'm okay with that. So I will just add to their kitty or buy whatever they want. And that will be that so somewhere in all this mess I missed stuff something or I miscalculated which you know surprise that's fine but if you found the mistake let me know and then I can move the money because I think Halloween was supposed to get five and now that's questionable questionable I'll just put that right there like Lisa what'd you do anyway that is it for savings challenge Monday and I hope you guys have a great rest of your week and that all is good where you are. And I will see you guys on the next video. Bye.